hello friends welcome to testing shala youtube channel in this video you will be learning about what is workflow testing in this video you will be learning in detail about workflow testing before moving further to understand workflow testing if you have visited testing shala youtube channel for the first time then please click on subscribe and bell notification so that all our future videos related to software testing will be there in your inbox that would help you to enhance your software testing skills. Let us move on and understand what is all about workflow testing. The workflow testing is also another functional testing which is equivalent to functional testing type. All the processes and procedures which is involved in the functional testing is applicable for workflow testing as well. That means the requirement gathering followed by test case creation, then followed by reviews, then test case execution, rising in defect, deploying into the production. All the procedures and processes is involved in the functional testing is applicable for workflow testing as well that is the first important definition of workflow testing and the main purpose of workflow testing is to test the business process flows the main purpose of workflow testing is to test the business process flows let me give an example if you take an example of your leave approval system your leave approval system where your supervisor or manager is having authority to approve your vacation. So let's say whenever you raise a request for your vacation, then based on the, the roles of the individual, let's say your supervisor can access the application and they can approve your vacation. In the same way, the invoice approval in your organization, it may go with multiple levels of approvals manager approval senior manager approval and followed by a director level approval everything is automated where as and when manager logs in he can you can you he can view his approvals the once a manager is approved the process goes to a senior manager entire process being automated here the so based on the individual roles he can find different rules or steps will get assigned to the individual. So based on that, he can perform his activity. That is where you are going to test the workflow testing, whether when individual person locks as a manager, what all the things he will see. And when he sees as a CNA manager, what all the things he can see. And he should ensure that the manager should not see CNA managers approvals in the same way you should not see director level approvals so that is where the security aspects it come into picture where the complete security of the application based on the roles of the individuals being assigned in that application and the overall process here the business process is approving the your invoice or approving your vacation. So your complete process is being automated using the application. That is the overall process being automated is the workflow process. The complete workflow process being automated based on the roles of the individual. So workflow testing is mainly used in the workflow based workflow based applications. As, as such as uh, your vacation approval system or it could be your invoice approval system and so on. Anywhere any application is having a business process that requires different approval mechanisms and it requires different workflow, then workflow testing is very important. I hope you are able to get hold of what is all about workflow testing. I hope you enjoyed watching this video. If you like this video, please click on like button. And if you have visited Testing Shala YouTube channel for the first time, 
then please click on subscribe and bell notification so that all our future videos related to software testing will be in your inbox that would help you to enhance your software testing skills. Thanks for watching this video. Bye for now. Take care.